dysfunctional vet. I have so many projects going on and I don't always document what I'm doing. I try to and unfortunately if I did I screwed up and didn't remember it. Let's look down here. See those? They're very evenly spaced. And we know that when we see something which is organized, an intelligent mind did that. In this case, an intelligent designer, and the intelligent designer is talking to you and telling you about it. Pretty cool, huh? No, I'm not God, in case somebody's wondering. But the spacing and all that's pretty good. I've been trying to figure out all day what these things are. I just figured it out. It's popcorn. I planted this some days before. Mystery solved. And all I had to do was uh, get busy doing some other project to remember what this project was. With that said, dysfunctional vet out. Dysfunctional vet. We had a fairly substantial thunderstorm come through last night. Right in here where you see this piece of blue glove and that piece of plastic, I planted about 30 to 35 popcorn seeds and that's one that's washed up. This series of holes right here, see those? That's where I planted the others, covered them lightly. Moving up here, I found a package of onions. I can't remember what they're called, the little red onions. And what you're supposed to do is boil them for about 30 seconds, cut the ends off, and then squeeze them out, and then put them in whatever you're cooking. Anyway, I found a package of those that I didn't know I had, so I put them out to see if they'll grow. I think a lot of them probably have already bit the dirt. Right here, I have yellow onions that I set out, I think four days ago, and I've kept them wet, but not soggy. I have these right here that were put out at least about two weeks ago, and they're looking fairly good. Need to put some more chips on them. And then of course I have my garlic right here. And the garlic is not looking that great right now. I'm going to soil test and see what I've got and then figure out if I need to give them a little more fertilizer. You need to feed these things about every two weeks. Also my asparagus is looking pretty good. Here is a brand new little baby coming up. Found him yesterday. I never pick asparagus when it first starts coming up because it needs that energy to grow. I won't do any of that for about two months. Also, if you grow asparagus, you need 15 per person. 15 plants per person. And I would say double that because you can't harvest 100%. That way you can always take one or two from the plants. And the stuff is slow growing. So I'd say at least 30 would give you a better chance. Now out here I'm going to pick up some of this. I've got a little bit of trash out here. That's garbage. And this is biodegradable, these things. I'm going to till it one more time and then I'm going to plant probably uh, around the 15th to the 20th. And I'll keep you posted on that. Dysfunctional bat out.